With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, so our question is, when a uniform metallic wire is stressed, the lateral strain produced is beta. If sigma and y are the Poisson's ratio and Young's modulus of the wire, then elastic potential energy density of the wire is. Okay, so we have been given a uniform metallic wire which is stressed then the lateral strain produced in it is beta and if sigma and y are representing the Poisson's ratio and Young's modulus of the wire then what will be the potential energy density of the wire. Okay, so we know that the Poisson's ratio sigma is given as minus of lateral strain upon longitudinal strain longitudinal strain okay so the lateral strain produced in the wire is beta so sigma will be equals to minus beta upon longitudinal strain longitudinal strain okay so from here the longitudinal strain longitudinal strain comes out as minus beta upon sigma okay now the potential energy density potential energy density is given as half into stress into longitudinal strain okay now as we know that the Young's modulus is given as stress upon longitudinal strain so from here the stress comes out as Young's modulus into longitudinal strain correct now substituting the value we get potential energy density as half into Young's modulus into longitudinal strain whole square okay so this will be equals to half into Young's modulus and longitudinal strain we have got as minus beta upon sigma whole square. So this will be equals to y beta whole square upon 2 sigma whole square. So the potential energy density finally comes out as Young's modulus into lateral strain whole square divided by 2 into Poisson's. So choosing out from the options we see that our option number 2 is correct. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.